Welcome back to the Awesome Possum Classroom. This is week nine, lesson one, daily kindergarten phonics. Rhyme time. A rhyme is a repeated sound in two or more words, like the at sound in cat, hat, and bat. Sat, bat. Repeat that, please. Sat, bat. Do you hear the at sound in sat and bat? Sat and bat rhyme. Now it's time to practice. Listen as I say two rhyming words. Repeat the words back to me. If the words rhyme, give me a thumbs up. If they do not rhyme, give me a thumbs down. Beg, keg. Thumbs up. Cut, gut. Thumbs up. Zip, sun. Thumbs down. Red, bed. Thumbs up. Cup, cat. Thumbs down. Good job. Now let's work on beginning sounds. Listen for the first sound in the word. Dive. What sound do you hear at the beginning of dive? Say the sound, not the letter. Duh. All right, listen to the words. What is the first sound you hear in each word? Egg. Eh. Itch. I. Up. Uh. Apple. Ah. Ox. Ah. Good job. Blending to make words means putting parts of a word together to make a word. B. Us. What word did I make? Bus. Okay, I want you to repeat after me. B, us, bus. Repeat that, please. Good job. B, us, bus. Now, I will say two parts of a word. I want you to say the parts back to me and then tell me what, wor what new word it makes. B, oat. Repeat that, please. What word does that make? Boat. Repeat after me. S, it. What word does that make? Sit. Very good. Repeat after me. F, it. What word does that make? Fight. Repeat after me. J, m. What word does that make? Gem. Repeat after me. Er, ack. What word does that make? Rack. Repeat after me. J, et. What word does that make? Jet. Excellent job. Let's work on ending sounds. Listen for the last sound you hear in the word. Rabbit. What sound do you hear at the end of rabbit? Say the sound, not the letter. T. Very good. All right. What sound do you hear at the end of sick? K. Very good. What sound do you hear at the end of mud? D. Very good. What sound do you hear at the end of sit? Very good. What sound do you hear at the end of enough? Good job. What sound do you hear at the end of dug? G. Good job. What sound do you hear at the end of ham? Mm. Good job. Now we will practice segmenting. 
Segmenting means listening to the whole word and then breaking it down into smaller parts. Now we will break words down into two parts. Repeat after me. Foot. 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 Repeat that, please. Foot. 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 Did you hear how we broke foot down into two parts? Foot. That's what we're going to do. This is what we're going to practice. I will say a word. Say the word back to me and chop it into two parts. The first sound and then the rest of the word. Okay? Tape. Break that into two parts. The first sound and then the rest of the word. Tape. T ape. Okay? Repeat after me. Tag. Break tag down into two parts. The first sound and then the rest of the word. T ag. Repeat after me. Tax. Break that word down into two parts. T ax. All right? Repeat after me. Nail. Break that word down into two parts. N ale. Repeat after me. Dog. Break that down into two parts. D og. Repeat after me. Peach. Break that word down into two parts. P each. Good job. Now, adding to the beginning of a word, we can change sounds at the beginning of a word to make to make new words. Say ug. Add er at the beginning of the word and the word is rug. All right. Say ock. Add d to the beginning of the word and the word is dock. Say ock. Add s to the beginning of the word, and the word is sock. Say ock. Add m to the beginning of the word, and the word is mock. Say ock. Take add j to the beginning of the word, and the word is jock. Say ock. Add er to the beginning of the word, and the word is rock. Good job. So let's take away a sound. We can take away a sound from a word and say what is left. Say chin without the ch. What is left? In. All right. Let's practice. Say dock. Without the d, what is left? Ock. Say sock. Without s, what is left? Ock. Say mock. Without the m. Mm, what is left? Ock. Say jock. Without the j, what is left? Ock. Say rock. Without the er, what is left? Ock. Good job. All right, we can change a sound to make a, a new word. Say sat. Change s to f, and the word is fat. All right, let's practice. Say pig. 
change p to er, and the word is rig. Say rig. Change er to b, and the word is big. Say big. Change b to d, and the word is dig. Say dig. Change d to f, and the word is fig. Say fig. Change f to w, and the word is wig. Good job. Let's learn the alphabet. We can learn letter names and letter sounds. Each letter has a name and a sound. I will ask you the letter and then the sound the letter makes. Are you ready? Let's go. What is the letter? F. What is the sound? F. What is the letter? H. What is the sound? <sighs> what is the letter? C. What is the sound? K. What is the letter? B. What is the sound? B. What is the letter? D, what is the sound? D. What is the letter? G, what is the sound? G. What is the letter? L, what is the sound? L. What is the letter? A, what is the sound? A. Ah. What is the letter? V, what is the sound? V. What is the letter? I, what is the sound? I. What is the letter? K, what is the sound? K. What is the letter? P, what is the sound? P. What is the letter? E, what is the sound? E. What is the letter? N, what is the sound? N. What is the letter? J, what is the sound? J. What is the letter? Q, what is the sound? Qua. What is the letter? R, what is the sound? Er. What is the letter? S, what is the sound? S. What is the letter? U, what is the sound? Uh. What is the letter? M, what is the sound? M. Mm. What is the letter? O, what is the sound? Ah. What is the letter? Z, what is the sound? Z. What is the letter? W. What is the sound? 
What? What is the letter? X. What is the sound? X. What is the letter? T. What is the sound? T. What is the letter? Y. What is the sound? Ya. Sight word practice. On each slide, there will be a sight word. You will have three seconds to say the sight word before we move to the next word. A. The. Two. R and has was is his now it's time to work with nursery rhymes with your teacher. Your teacher will say a line. You will say the line and clap the number of words in the line. Count how many words are in each line. Circle the sight words. Count the syllables in the words and underline the rhyming words. Teachers, pause the video so that you can do this activity with your class. Thank you for working along with the Awesome Possum Classroom. See you tomorrow.